that shit. What is going on guys? It is BaseSM and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to install multiplayer mod on one of my favorite games, Kerbal Space Program. We're going to be using the dark multiplayer mod and I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up the client just so you guys can get to servers, but I will do a separate video on how to make your servers. So just go ahead and open up Google, type in KSP DMP for Kerbal Space Program dark multiplayer mod. Go ahead and downloads, update your client, hit those, real, hit those two real quick as you can see already have those you can go ahead and hit show and folder I don't need those anymore so as you can see I have them on my desktop you guys are going to want to go to your directory your steam directory or your game directory it's probably in your steam so it's probably going to be in program files 86 you're going to want to look for steam then you want to go to common and then Kerbal Space Program and so what you're going to want to do you're going to open this up right here you want to take the dark multiplayer client and drag it into the folder, not into any specific folder, just in the whole directory. I'm not going to do that because I already have it, but it's going to show you dark multiplayer mod. And as you can see, now it would be in the game data, dark multiplayer mod, and then you can see it has the same stuff. After that, you're going to drag the updater into the main directory as well. Go ahead and run this as an administrator if you do have uh, privilege issue issues. You can hit enter and uh, it will run that. Mine just runs automatically, but sometimes you do have to hit a button to get it going. But then it'll say your uh, client's up to date because sometimes uh, if you don't do that, uh, the game won't work. So let's hop into Kerbal and show you what it should look like. All right, guys, once you have that installed, this is what you're going to see. This is going to be the name you have when you join the server. You can just go to add a server and then uh, in the IP, just put the server address, the IPv4 server address, if it is one of your friends. Add it, give it whatever name you want, and then connect. I have to go open my server because it's closed. Let me run this real quick. Just so I can show you guys it is working. Right here. Looks good, I see everything on the left. On the server side connecting, and as you can see, we are in. This is a debug menu. If you need to do any of that, you can take screenshots, but mainly you don't really need that, so you can close it. And uh, this is me and Predator server. As you can see, we have, a, we have a lot going on around here, so that's pretty cool. But I hope that helped you out, guys. And uh, leave a comment if you have any questions, but make sure to subscribe, and we'll see you next time.